Hello guys, um, my name is Sungat and um, today I'm gonna explain you the subchapter 20.3 which is about iterators. Uh, this is my home task and I must do it. So uh, firstly I want to show you the diagram of the um, iterator interface. Oh, sorry, that's not. Um, the iterator interface and as you can see has only three methods. Um, has next which returns true if the iteration has more elements uh, the next method which returns the element from this iterator ah, which returns the next element from this iterator sorry and the remove method which removes the last element so uh, that's simple I think uh, so now guys uh, I want to write some code and um, uh, I think it will help you to understand better the iterator interface and, and his methods. I mean that you will see uh, how I will use it and how should we use it, how should we call the methods and how should we create an iterator and uh, let's start. So firstly uh, we are creating a collection. So we've created a collection and we want to add some elements to this collection. I think the four elements will be enough. So first element is So we've created a collection and add some elements to this collection by calling the method add. Now uh, I want to create an. Oh no, no. Uh, now we want to create. Uh, yeah, now we want to create an iterator and to create an iterator you should write like this. And uh, now I want to explain something. Uh, you cannot use here keyword new. Uh, why? Because an iterator is an interface and you should uh, write like this iterator. So uh, here we are calling the method iterator. Um, where does it come? From where? Uh, collections extend the iterable interface. So the iterable interface has a method iterator. This iterator method is returning the uh, instance of iterator and now you know how to create an iterator. So now for example you want to print all elements uh, of in this collection. Uh, to do it firstly we should create a loop statement iter dot has next this loop will work until we oh no not until while we, while we have an element in this collection so now uh, to print the element of the collection we should get it to get it we will use an um, next uh, method iter dot next then just print it So if I'm not uh, if I'm not mistaken, it will uh, print all elements from this collection. Uh, iterator. So let's let yeah the work. Iterator. Yeah, as you can see, it prints all elements. It printed all elements. So now, uh, for example, you want to remove all elements from this collection, and to do it, we'll again we'll use a while loop with an iterator has next 
and to remove the element we should get it uh, because in iterator we don't have any element now uh, so to get it we will use um, next method and just remove it uh, remove and system dot print line collection hmm. now we will run it and I think we will not get anything yeah we will not get anything and why so because this iterator uh, reached the end uh, here and we will you can't use it here because uh, the uh, statement here will be false because uh, it reached the end it will, and there is no element uh, and to um, to fix it we should just uh, create a new iterator if I'm not mistaken dot iterator um, so change here here and here and now it should work yeah it is working as you can see uh, we get a first element we get a first element and uh, then we are removing it and the result will be uh, second, third and uh, fourth element so and it will uh, repeat while we have an, an elements in this iterator so I hope guys that uh, this video will be understandable for you and helpful thank you